Hey babes, my name is Tamara Blair. Welcome back to another video featuring Asha and Sia. <laughs> and crab. <laughs> so today we are gonna just eat some crab, have some conversation, and that's it. Nothing else. <laughs> This is what I'm here for. Ooh, yeah. I'm getting the exclusive. It's gonna be lit. I'm telling you, different different vibes. It's gonna be like of an interracial mix. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna do a little bit of rap, a little bit of singing, DJ. Mm -hmm. It's just a mixture of Shensia and what I have to offer. Yeah, a couple people from there are just you want to do the solo thing. Mm -mm. Definitely. I have a good amount of features. Who's like your dream? Like, who would I say, like your dream collab? Like, who do I sing with? Hmm. I would say Rihanna. Yes! Because ever since she came on the scene, mm -hmm. you know, I've been watching her from the very first day. You get me? Mm -hmm. Watching her on BET, MTV, straight up. Straight up. Yeah. To where she is right now. So definitely Rihanna is one of my biggest inspirations where music is concerned yeah. and I absolutely just love her. I love her vibe, how, how she carries herself, how she deals with the media, just everything about her. So like when I talk about Rihanna, so you see how she like, like me like how she, she in a little bit of everything. You see yourself opening like any businesses like makeup like i i see you do your makeup a lot of times and it look real nice mm -hmm. when i do it by yourself thank you so you see yourself about venture into like a makeup line or maybe lashes nothing like that makeup mm -mm. lashes i'm about to do lashes you gonna do lashes yeah right now i'm starting that out but for me i i'm a shoes freak <laughs> I love shoes, Jesus. I love shoes. I love swimwear, so maybe even that too. So, yeah. I just, my merch entirely. Mm -hmm. Makeup, not so much. Yeah, but, what I mean, like, if it comes where I have, I can collaborate with somebody else, like, then that's fine. Yeah, I would do like, I would say if you just merch or, yeah, I would do like a separate thing for everything. I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna have about two or three websites, maybe. Mm -hmm. So, the first one right now is what we're starting out with the lashes. Mm -hmm. And then the next one for my merch, like my tees and my hats yeah. and all of that. And probably the third, I don't know yet. Still thinking about it. No, sir. It's spicy. I some love it. I it want to say this, this is not hot enough. I like. Uh -huh. I'm gonna touch the water, it's not, it's not budge me. <laughs> So I have yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Hot body. Lord. Yeah. Yeah. So if you would I choose, where would I say a favorite tier of shoes? I don't have a favorite brand because I love shoes so much. It could all be one where I said downtown. I mean, like <laughs> the style. Mm -hmm. You get me? I just need that. Like, I'm not, I'm not business about brands and all of it. It's just that once I like it, I just like it. Yeah. So I don't have a favorite. That's how much I love shoes. I love heels and I love sneakers. You get me? So I can't I can't really say. But my go-to though, when I just pop in, in and pop in out, mm -hmm. just casually, it's probably like an Air Force. Yeah. Yeah, I think you're gonna do like a closet tour, like show all your shoes then. Well, Probably when mom build the dream house. Otherwise, I don't think it's necessary. Really. Fish away. Yeah. So they plan to live on stage to make area come over here, so overseas. Before I said I wanted to live in Jamaica, but now 
I think I want to live in Jamaica and I also live in probably Miami mm -hmm. or LA. Yeah, no Jamaica. Yeah, so I wanna have like you know, the house mm -hmm. in Jamaica and a house somewhere else. But Jamaica, I just can't ever live there. Same. No, no. I have to just go back a yard, go get some food. Yep. Yeah. River. Mm -hmm. Vibes party. Just a different vibe entirely in Jamaica, so yeah, I can't yeah. find that elsewhere and I've been traveling for years now. Yeah, I'm feeling, man. And no, it's sun is too nice. What do you mean? It's hot, man. No sun. I run the lip right there, though. Ramesh, yeah. this body. <laughs> I enjoy it. Happy and nice. Mm. Oh, sir. Woo! Any secret love you are going to reveal soon? I figured it from Asa. <laughs> no, honestly, as a god, where did you get it from? Everywhere. No, listen, in my line of work, it's not that easy. People might think it's easy, but it's not for me to find somebody. Okay. Majority of the top people that actually do have access to me, mm -hmm. they ain't shit really. Girl, stop. Not at all. I like it too. For real. Not at if you even get in a relationship with you. Mm -hmm. You see me? And I'm not a person that I don't normally go for artists. So it's even, that even make it harder. Why? Well, and yeah, I like like a whole public thing, like everybody in your business. I actually like the public thing, you know, but it's just that men nowadays is not the same as what I require. Mm -hmm. I'm an old fashioned type of person. You get me? Nowadays, man just feel like sitting for a 20 woman, mm -hmm. juggling and juggling. No, sir. I'm not even that. I'm not even to say, yo, we can't even settle down. I'm just still looking at each other face forever. Mm -hmm. You get me? Of course, we can explore as long as, you know, there's just honesty and trust and you can't really find that nowadays like everybody are like that yeah and everybody has stunt for image so you find enough man like they just attack to your feet they come up they what they which come up they not get so far <laughs> <laughs> mm -mm. nah i would i wouldn't i wouldn't say mm -mm. I mean, in time still. Can it be a big girl? Why to all the world around right now? Because <laughs> I'm going to keep my exam safe and lock with <laughs> For real. I love babies though. I really, really love babies. Boy or girl, I just really want to have an ex. Another one? Yeah. So oh. I guess when I go to school with everything I want, I guess I go to homeschool. Both. Yeah, listen. You're not afraid. Honestly, I have to see. I have to see what happens when the place actually when, when January comes. Mm -hmm. Cause not right now. No, I wouldn't say no. Yeah. But when January comes, let's see. But the reason why I would rather to send him to school, cause I do train him at home as well, mm -hmm. is that I want him to get. You know, I don't want him to be socially awkward. I want him oh, to yeah. get out there and, you know. And he doesn't have a sibling. So it's like him, me, and beer big people around him. Mm -hmm. You get me? I need him to have his peers, his own age group, so he can grow and, and experience every age yeah. and aspects of his life as a kid. Oh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You done? I can't do it. <coughs> Metal board? Yeah, man. I'm not bad. I'm not bad. Easy car, man. No, sir. Wash off. Wash off. Wash off the crab. No, sir. No, man, this is bad. I don't know. I love it. So, you never get you with like muscle in it? Like, they put muscle in there, you know? Yeah, but I never take it with muscle. As I said, crab is my favorite seafood, you know? I need to eat crab straight. Curry, garlic, yeah, man, curry. fry. Garlic. Huh? No, sir, I never heard that. I don't know. You don't have garlic. No. People. People. <laughs> Why do you care about Jamaica? You know? So, so like that, like, they're boiling or? They're boiling. 
I'll just cook it down with pure garlic and skin. Yeah, yeah mm -hmm. I love garlic crab. I do try to make a curry. You hear a curry though? Yeah. Yeah, man. Garlic bag too. Crab in a soy sauce. Mm -hmm. Yes, do you, um, so what was the inspiration behind Lighter? The video of everybody, huh? Oh, yes, talk about the video, buddy. You see the video? Me see the, the clip alone. <laughs> Yeah, thank you. But it was more of a vibe cinema because actually that wasn't the first song that we started working on, you know. Mm. But somehow we felt like, you know, we have something else in store that we could have, you know, mm. do a separate apart from the vibe that we had before. And it was just a vibe. In the studio with me and Tara was just there. We were just chilling and as, as a matter of fact, we, we, we worked on that song for probably, if you add the days together, it's probably just one week straight. Yeah, oh, wow. that's because you know the COVID and everything. Yeah, everybody they are trying to adjust and all of that. So we still make it work at the end of the day. You get me? Yeah, the video like, though, I can't wait to see the video. Yeah, I haven't seen the video yet. I like how the like when I sit on funny chair, I like that blades. <laughs> I hate that image. Yeah, yeah, I like it too. When I saw it, I was like, yes. Mm -hmm. I can't wait to see them on this. I can't wait to see them on this. You feel me in Jamaica? Mm-hmm. One spot, look out, the red is. And the next spot, at the studio. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't want to touch my water, people. <laughs> can't do it at all. You're bad, man, you're bad. Listen. Me and Peppa are big friends. Yeah. What kind of advice would I give anyone like a coming out industry? Not just music, but just the entertainment business altogether. One, hmm. the back of a broad. Mm. Two, don't do it and don't get into it unless you really love it because that's the only way you're going to withstand it. Mm. That's the only way you're going to always have. You know, self motivation. We can persevere and push yourself on and move forward. Because trust me, in our entertainment, you're rough. And you give up a lot of things, especially one, especially in your personal life. Yeah. And your privacy. That's true. But, eh? If you don't watch yourself, some things can be seen and taken the wrong way mm -hmm. just by how it is portrayed to the media. It's not always true. So you just have to know how for maneuver. And, and move around it and just get up back again and how to just navigate your whole entire lifestyle. I don't know, like, I, I feel like I have a passion for it, but like, that's the main aspect that scares me is just the people. People. Mm -hmm. so. <laughs> that's it. For me, I always wanted to be an artist. Alright? So, it's like, Growing up, I mm -hmm. feel like this is my destiny because growing up, I used to get bullied a lot. Really? What? Yeah, like... What am I saying? Like Grammy high school or before? Primary that? school to high school. People are getting up on me just for come try to cut off my hair. I, I want to see my last time I did bad my hair. good hair. <laughs> Listen. Oh, gosh. Then we say people bully you because, oh, you look a certain way, but you still get bullied. Mm -hmm. With... When you have light skin, dark skin, long ear, short ear, you still get bullied. And I am a living example of that. So that is that is why I can deal with this now. Because mm. I've been going through it for a long time. Skin tough now. Long time. Mm -hmm. <sighs> so till now, I just use them for motivating. Mm. It's just always a constant. You know when haters are like, oh this is no good, this is no good. They make me want to do it to make it become better. This motivation for me. I love when I'm at top body. I'm at top body. I try to give him something to top body. Give him more. <laughs> yeah. So it's just about you and the type of person who you are. That's why I'm saying if you don't really love it, mm -hmm. don't get into it. No. Because that's where they say most people just fall. Yeah. They come up big and then they just drop. Drop down. Mm -hmm. Because they, they don't really love it that much to even push forward no more. I told my love people come out 
big like and then, then just chop on. Mm -hmm. Now you're frying them. Some of them still, because you know some of them just I don't know. Book up on something. In your health issue or something. Mm -hmm. so, or a bad company. Or doctor. Ooh. Yeah. They sing in a shower too, like it makes them like right? Nice yeah. shower? No, sir. Me? You know, go I'm too me. busy. I'm too busy. I put on myself in the shower because when I bathe, you know, my water is hot till my back is red. Yeah, me too. Mm -hmm. So, how oh, you don't like this? No, sir. This hmm? this how I hold different. I hold my mouth and I see my nose around. <laughs> okay. mm -hmm. I don't know. Anything, if you're sick with anything, nice system to pepper drain it out. Mm -hmm. So, all this is very good. Not even but I'm leaving all now. Oh, this so one funny. What is the most useless talent you think you have? Useless talent? Like something weird where you do? <laughs> but not think. Because for me, no. Ah, art. Yeah. You can draw? And paint. Oh. I used to design in high school. I got a two in CXC. But from a left high school, mm -hmm. I don't see about that. Like, I don't even do nothing for people because I'm so focused, you know, with a, a different type mm -hmm. of art, which is music. So I'm an artist both ways. Like, I'm paint, draw. Multi talented. <laughs> so that's, that, that's what I would say. But I really want to get back in it just for, like, you know, as a hobby. Mm -hmm. But nowadays, I find myself just cooking more, being a hobby and just being a mom. Oh, yeah, sometimes I watch your, your like recipe them for Instagram, man. Nah. Yeah, so I'm gonna do the crab. I'm gonna show it. I'm gonna show it. I'm gonna show it. I'm gonna show it. This name garlic crab. <laughs> God, I don't know what I can't believe. And that's actually one of my specialties that I love to cook. Garlic crab? Yeah. No, tell me what you're doing there. Yeah, because I do mine a bit differently. But I'm gonna show it on the crab one day. <laughs> Whew. Well, me can't do no more, so I eat that people. Thank you so much for doing this video with me. Thank you for having me. And thanks for me, Steve, Pippa Crab. <laughs> Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. I'm still there. So now I'm gonna do this now. It's just if I want to smell this. Yeah, I like this smell. Mm? You know, I like this smell? Yeah. Mm -hmm. No, I love it. I love seafood. I love oh. crab.